last year I chose to paint my granddaughter. I had no idea how to paint something that might appeal to other people, but she was 15, going on 80, as teenage girls are these years. Um, she was on the cusp, which is what I call the painting. I had her face painted, or I face painted her, and then painted her with the face painting on. So she looked like a child around the skin, but the eyes were very, very mature. I paint anything, but people, it's their, what's inside them, and you just hope you catch a little bit of it. This year I had absolutely no intention of, of entering again. There was no way I could get hung a second time. We've moved to Brisbane and our local gallery was having an exhibition this year, not a competition, an exhibition of paintings done by artists of themselves. And I've never thought of doing a self-portrait, it just wouldn't have interested me. They had to be A4 and the gallery then frames them and they fill a wall with local artists painting of themselves. It sat on my easel for three weeks after I'd done it and I thought, I've got to send that to the Moran. <laughs> and my husband supported it, so I did. I don't have a career. I just love painting. I just sit at home and worry a painting to death. But it's not a career. I didn't start until I was in my 50s. It's just a wonderful interest. I just can't believe it. It is, I don't, I find it surprising that I fit in at all.